All right, what's up, Hot Squad? Welcome back to my Hot Banger Recap Marathon. So finally, yes, Cool Uno 9. I have not had a freaking chance to do a Cool Uno 9 recap in a month. A month. I think it's been a month I did a recap, but I'm excited to see this one because this is a recap for Deadpool, and it's called Deadpool Violates Merca on Traffic to Run the Fade with Francis. As you may know, Deadpool Wolverine is coming out already in like three weeks, I believe, in three freaking weeks already. I'm so excited for it, man. I can't believe it. Three weeks. I've already got my ticket for IMAX, so hopefully I'll We'll get a chance to review on it. I know it's been so long. I did like a short review on the movies, but maybe I might do it. Who knows? But yes, Deadpool Wolf is coming out in three weeks, so this is great timing here. Get a recap of you know Deadpool, mostly half the story in the movie. So I'm excited to see this. So how's for further ado? We're going to check out Cool Uno 9's recap of Deadpool right now. Let's get straight to it. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. All right, so the movie starts off with Deadpool sitting on the freeway, listening to Salt and Pepper, drawing how he's gonna do his ops, and then his ass jumps through the roof. Did you like that? I'm hearing that in the background. I'm hearing that. Window of this all black suburban, throwing elbows immediately, not caring about any of the collateral damage he caused. Damn. I'm talking about he flipped the hell out of this car. What did they do? They're just regular people. Like I said, when he got to that car through this nasty ass elbow, <laughs> Held bro on his left back just to kick the dude in the passenger seat. He then slammed old dude into some glass, punched him in the nuts. Mm. Then Deadpool uses old boy on his right to headbutt the driver. And then his ass German suplexes him out of the car. <laughs> but then Deadpool starts getting hard pressed. But Deadpool elbows him off him. Kicks him and then he snaps his neck with his legs. That's a crazy way to go out, gang. Yeah. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Mm -hmm. His ass then punches the driver and he pulls up on the passenger, showing him his Francis drawing, saying, Hey, you seen this dude? As his ass gets sternum checked and then he gets his head cartoon shoot back to get the radio and changes the song with each bash. And we see this dude on a motorcycle pull up. But we pan back to Deadpool, and he's just getting a fistful of CTE right now. Yeah. And the dude in the motorcycle pulls out a Uzi, starts letting the Yopper spray. Aimlessly, he just killed one of his friends. Yeah. And Deadpool drop kicked the hell out of his dead body out of the car, breaking the door, and taking mm. out the dude on the motorcycle. And all I gotta say is, what did the dude on the motorcycle accomplish? He said he pulled up, killed his friends, and then died. Like, come on now, bro. Yeah, you have to have right. a plan going in on this. But the individual that got suplexed out of the car, he did not pass away. He starts climbing back through the trunk of the car. So Deadpool punches the driver in the nuts again, having bro speed up into the other suburban in front of them. They crash, and then Mr. Suplex Man flies through the car, breaks his neck on the dashboard. But when he was not finished with his ass, because he starts pressing his foot up against the head of the driver as he takes out the cigarette lighter in the car, stamps Lil Bro on his forehead, shoves it in his mouth, and he mm. said, don't swallow. And then another black suburban pulls up to the side of the car, then pulls in. Then the windows roll down, and they all nonchalantly turn their head at Bro. After the way Wade has been piecing y'all boys up, you do not have the audacity to nonchalantly turn y'all head. <laughs> so Wade puts his speed racer driving skills to the test, puts his foot on the steering wheel, and whips the hell out of the alley. Having the car do about 50 11 barrel rolls as the yep. dude in front of their car pulls out the Uzi, and I don't know what he thought he was Seriously. going to accomplish with a barreling vehicle 14 times the size as his pulling up on him at the speed of sound, and he pulls out an Uzi. I'm telling you, my guy, you are not like that. <laughs> because Deadpool casually scoops Bro up off his motorcycle, and as the car's still flipping, giving everybody a the shot, down for CTE, Deadpool's like, damn. Valley the stove, <laughs> And then we go back to reality. The dumbass motorcyclist that tried to shoot a barreling car got what was coming to his dumbass. I'm not even gonna lie. Because the chain off his motorcycle beheaded his ass and flung one of the passengers in the car up into this road sign, making him just splat on the wall. And all I'm gonna say is having the hand eye coordination to do all that in the span of like five seconds. I know if it was me, I would have missed the steering wheel of my foot about four times. Fell out the car, and the only thing I did today was cause a minor traffic inconvenience on the road. And then I would have walked my black ass home, sad and defeated. <laughs> but the car crashed, and the other mercs pull up on Deadpool. He's like, hold on, hold on, chill, chill, chill. If you're wondering why I wear red, it's so the bad guys can't see me bleed. <laughs> and then he points to the dude wearing the brown pants, and he's like, He's got the right idea. They then started letting the yopper spray on Deadpool. Like, all right, all right, chill, bro. Only got 12 bullets. Y'all just gonna have to share them all. So his ass jumps up in the air, gets two quick scope headshots with this pistol, and a third motorcycle individual pulls up. And I'm not gonna lie, he the only one to ever do anything. Because his ass zooms past Deadpool and pieces his ass up with his Uzi. 
But old boy spun back on Deadpool, and his ass got mad with the food boots on, bro. Hitting absolutely nothing but air balls on his ass. And I don't know how this nigga got hired to be a mercenary for anybody. Deadpool is to the left of you. All you got to do is turn around a little bit. And even if you tell him you didn't see the 6'3 ass nigga in an all <laughs> red suit out of your peripheral, <laughs> if his ass survived today, he'd need to go find a new line of work. Because the mercenary business is not for you, big dog. <laughs> but Deadpool shot Stevie Wonder in the head over <laughs> here. And the other mercenaries start shooting at Deadpool. And his ass starts booking him. And I just know Deadpool got a nasty 40 yard dash. He is in the wrong profession. He need to be on the field giving niggas CTE for money. But his ass goes to the other side of the car that this Merc is shooting at and bro has to reload but Deadpool pops his head up out the window and he starts letting the opera spray bro gets on the hood of the car he sees Deadpool just posing <laughs> he starts trying to shoot his gun but he shot every bullet out the magazine and Deadpool's like oh you should have been counting your bullets and blooms his ass then these two other Mercs pull up one tries to throw a grenade at Deadpool and oh nah uh, he, he shot shoots that. the grenade yep. in bro's hand before he can even throw it and he just explodes God and dang. his ass starts emoting Ah oh, hell nah if I were <laughs> them I'd be looking up from hell cursing his name <laughs> this is insane I'm not gonna let you emote on my body. You're about to get the nastiest of divine retributions in a little bit. Don't even worry about it. And then Deadpool gets shot in the ass, bro. That's what he gets for real. I ain't even gonna lie, he deserved that. But while his ass is on the ground, he boom, bro, in the head, they shot him. Mm. Deadpool's ass got mad as hell. He fired two more off into bro's dead body. Now we only got one bullet left. But then three more mercs pop up. But his ass lines up the yep. shot and gets this nasty ass triple collect. It's such a good I shot, man. God ass dang. Was face puts back in the day. <sighs> but after he got rid of all the mercs, Damn, man. he starts looking for Francis in the car. That was me. His ass is not there. But then one of the mercenaries there pull shot directly in the head, might I add. This just gets up like nothing happened. He takes the bullet out of his forehead and pulls out some knives, getting ready to run the ones with Deadpool. And bro, look, listen to me. I know you don't get paid enough for this. Why'd you get back up? If I got shot in the head and I somehow survived and the nigga that shot me in the head is still in the vicinity, I'm playing dead until he leaves. He <laughs> yeah. thinks he's red explode. He is not likes that for real. <laughs> so old dude pulls up on Deadpool. But Mr. Wilson pulls out his katana and stabs him directly in his chest two times and lifts his ass up. And then he cuts his body in half. Yep. And then he hears a motorcycle rev up. And he's like, oh yeah, that's that bitch ass nigga Francis right there. I'm finna get him. So this nigga Francis started dipping on his motorcycle. But Deadpool said, nah, nah, nah. Bring that ass right here, boy. He jumped off this car, threw his katana precisely between the wheels of Francis' motorcycle. And his ass goes flying. And then Wade starts playing with Mans. He lines up the shot and hits Francis with this nasty ass Randy Orton punch. Kick. <laughs> Motorcycle helmet still on, by the way. I know that didn't help anything at all. He tried to shoot his ass with the Uzi, but Wade caught it and kicked his ass right in the face once more. And then Bro starts violent. I'm talking about he is giving Francis devious <laughs> back shots right now. And then he tosses his ass on the railing of the highway. Then he hits his ass with a goddamn V trigger, German suplex, Randy Orton punch kick. V trigger, this nigga Deadpool is a wrestling fan 100%. This. But that V trigger Deadpool hit friends with knocked his helmet clean the hell off. Then his ass pulled at his katana and stabbed Francis right in the chest. Yes, and yep. he starts talking crazy mess. And then Colossus pulls up and chunks Deadpool into a car. And then Wade starts talking crazy mess to Colossus. He turns around and Francis is no longer there. He tries to beat up Colossus but breaks three of his yeah. bones in the process. So Colossus cuffed Deadpool and tried to take his ass away. But Deadpool cut his arm off and jumped in the garbage truck. And in the fight. Moral of the story is don't be an asshole. But <laughs> other than that man, I'm gonna get up out of here. If you like, like, comment, subscribe, do the good stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm out of here. Bye. All right, W recap, cool Uno. Yeah, I definitely remember the times I saw Deadpool for the first time. Freaking loved it. I'm, like I said, I'm definitely excited for Deadpool Wolverine to come out in three weeks. I'm gonna let my calendar right. 
Yeah, about three weeks, man. Three freaking weeks. I mean, damn, man. That's already coming. And I already got my ticket. So I'm excited to see that. So yeah, W recap, cool Uno, W recap. I'm definitely I might check out the first two dead pools before I can see that pool ring. Cause it's been a while since the first two. So yeah, I'm definitely, definitely excited for that. So Hot Squad, that's my conclusion of my reaction to Cool Uno 9's recap of Deadpool. So if you enjoyed this, please hit that button. Comment share your thoughts. How many times have you seen the first Deadpool? Are you very excited for Deadpool Wolverine? I know you are. And what do you think this is going to be the best Deadpool in the series, in the trilogy? I hope it is. I really freaking hope it is, man. I mean, come on. <laughs> so yeah, man. Yeah, I'm definitely excited for that. So Hot Squad, please stay tuned because I have another Cool Uno 9 recap in my Hot Banger reaction marathon. And that is his recap for his Kendrick Lamar and Drake recap. So of course, I know this what's it gonna be about. So Hot Squad, please stay tuned for that. <laughs>